Morning YouTube. I woke up uh, just a little bit ago, was having breakfast and reading the news and the first thing I see it's another attack in France. A lot of people died in Nice at uh, Bastille Day yesterday night. Those things are happening every other day from Bangladesh to Iraq to Turkey. It, um, it leaves you speechless. It just leaves you speechless. I never thought that in 2016 the world would look like this. It's like on a fast track to go back into the dark ages. I know for certainty that millions of Muslims and, and Christians and Jews or whatever other religion, we want nothing more than to be united together. Expressing your own identity through religion, it's fine. But we also have to come to the conclusion of going back to the source of all of this, you know, like I'm sure that from science to even scholars or religious people of every kind, we start to understand that there is one source from where all those stories of Genesis or whatever came from. So one spirituality at the core of everything. We have to be united in that thought, in that prayer. It's the only way we can overcome those differences and also heal the sickened mind of those gullible people that they're easily manipulated into being indoctrinated by by evil heal ideas and they carry on those brutal acts against their own kind, humanity. Because terrorism is created and the only way we can cure it is by by knowledge, by by compassion, by empathy, by getting closer to one another. The West has done a lot to fuel rage and anger in the Mideast for decades and this is an outcome of that kind of fierce anger and distortion in the mind of people that manifests into those extremists. So this is not a... I'm not surprised by it but I'm appalled by it because we are better than this. I refuse to believe that there isn't enough love in this world to, to heal all the wounds. You wake up and it feels almost like you woken up in the wrong universe, in a parallel universe. Like some kind of, like Back to the Future 2 where Marty McFly just woke up in, in the wrong 1985, you know, where Buford Tanner was the ruler of everything and evil took over. It's, it's just that bizarre and, and, and feels like, how is this possible? Every other day an attempt, every other day some crazy person carries on like those incredible tragic acts against kids and it just leaves you speechless but I refuse to think that I refuse to give in on, on people I refuse to, to think that we cannot get closer and get better I know that the only way we can do that from a point of view of just a human being, one person is to get closer. All those religions have to get closer spiritually. We cannot anymore justify the separation of beliefs. There must be a source where everything started from and we have to accept that. We cannot just believe that one story of Genesis is better than another and we keep fighting each other over those things. It's just not possible anymore. This is not the 2016 I was hoping for when I was a child. I imagine so much different. Perhaps already traveling into space to other planets where diseases were developed and, and cured all kinds of diseases. And we are there for many things. We have been advancing so much. But I truly hope that people will win good people, we are billions and billions of humans that just want to get along and want to express love and appreciation for existing and for living and to enjoy our life and to ensure that our kids have the same opportunities and grow into a better world. Just my few thoughts. I see you tomorrow and have a good day. Peace.